Hello everyone, here we are. We are just about to enter Altrade's Abbey and fight Cardinal Sin, I guess is his name. There is a... Alright, can I explore this floor a bit, or...? The door appears to be locked. There's a... Buffalo of sorts right there. Oh no, it's an actual monster. Alright. We haven't fought them before, so it's Wynoceros. Oh, at least we got the Chimera. Ah, Crackle! And she finishes off the other two. She's not bad. Oh, damn it. Is it rough? No, it's not, sorry. HP goes up by 6, MP by 3. 3, strength, 3, agility, 1, resilience, 4, wisdom, 2, style. Uh, maybe, depending on work. We might be able to do Palace of the Dead. Yay, Swanoceros. Alright, fight. Let's use the snooze stick on the Swanoceros. Damn it. Well, at least two of them died. Rough stands firm. I always say depending on work, because it is always depending on work. Because I do work most of the time that you want to do these things. Shit, I went right into that one. It's not what I wanted to do. Come now, friend. Surely this experience you have gained in combat is reward enough? Surely the journey of self-discovery has given you ample freedom? Don't give me that mumbo-jumbo. I want real freedom. I want your stupid arena challenge. Fair and square, now let me leave. As you wish, you will be permitted to leave. Or rather, your corpse will. Oh, well. <laughs> it seems I got a little carried away. There won't even be a corpse to dispose of this time. <laughs> Hi, Priestess! What an honor! But you are too late. The power required to bring our master back to strength has already been gathered. We have no more need of your precious human supplicants and their so-called skills. The power to reap from the desperation of combatants in our little arena proved far more important than we had imagined. We do not think you will be allowed to leave this place. You and your kind have outlived your usefulness. As such, you will be disposed of. All of you! <laughs> Alright, so I hear this fight is actually difficult. So, Cardinal Sin. Let's give Ruff a buff. Let's give you a sap. We're still okay. Hit Jacqueline, I don't care about that. Yeah, I'm not gonna cast any spells on you anyway, so... Critical hit! Oh yeah! That's good. 
Dolce Zabby segment was the most difficult part in the game, in your opinion? That's what I've been reading other people say, too. I don't really remember this part too well from the PlayStation, so it can't be... Only able to heal 30 makes this game extremely difficult, yeah. <laughs> Maribel takes two damage. Get fucked, buddy. Okay, never mind. I was wrong. He was not that difficult. 687 EXP. Then again, I am like level 20, so... Thanks to Sasser and his companions, the monsters plan to channel the power drained from humans to their master, the mighty Demon King, ends in failure. The priests and guards of all trades, freed from captivity at last, flood back into the Abbey and drive out all interlopers. And with all the monsters gone, the Abbey begins to recover its familiar atmosphere and energy. Then, a few days later... Dearie, dearie me, will the princess ever grow up and stop trying to give me her, her poor parents a heart attack every five minutes? With everyone having left town, there was no sense keeping the bank over at in Pilgrim's Perdition open. Now I'm wondering what my next career move should be. Oh no, I just remembered I left that strange stone object of one of our customers left... Uh, I left behind for so safekeeping. Ah oh, well, they never came back to collect it, and I don't expect there'll be many unsavory sorts snooping the uh, around the place. It's probably fine just staying there. The monsters have all been booted out. The place and pieces finally returned to All Trades Abbey. Best of all, I'll finally be able to change my vacation. But for the moment, I already have a job to get be getting on with it. All right, well, I don't think we need to use the inn. I feel like since we started here, they probably already healed us, and they did. Excellent. And you're sure you have no regrets, even after having been through so much to fulfill your dream of working here. Yeah, I decided to leave for me, mate. A common thief ain't got no business working in a big posh old place like this. Tough for the opportunity and all, but I ain't cut out for the old elite bodyguard game. Well, I for one will be sad to see you go. Oh, don't give me that. You never wanted me working here in the first place. Do you think I couldn't tell? No, no, that that is I, um... Listen... I know when it's time for me to sling you, sling me up. It's been nice knowing you and your mates, Cesar. Right? Be lucky, eh? Be lucky. Take care, Esther. Oh, and uh, give me regards to Zev Bloke and his sister, won't you? So fingers is gone. I suppose it will be soon time for Nev and Z Na Zev and Nava to leave too. I wonder if I could persuade Nava to stay here with me. God, but even just she wanted to say, we still have Zev to contend with. Why do things have to be so complicated? We've only just chased the monsters out, but things are already getting back to the way they were. It won't be long before we run off our feet, just like the, uh, old days. The good old days. Ah, it's great to be back doing this again. We're not going to let any rotten monsters pull a stunt like that ever again. I heard the past that B are planning on hiring scores of new guards to boost the Abbey's defenses. I suppose we did leave ourselves rather vulnerable to relying on such small force to protect us. I spent ages researching ways to change my vocation and become a hero with minimal effort. Sadly, it doesn't look like I'm going to be finding a shortcut to savior status anytime soon. Yeah, there you are. You can be the first to congratulate me on my new job. I've just become a warrior. So what do you think? I'm looking tougher already, right? My sister will be impressed. I just know she will. Well, anyway, n no time to chat. See you around. Welcome to the web shop. What can I do for you? All right, giant malice, wizard staff. Hopefully this is an enemy battle. I might want to get one of those. But you don't have anything worthwhile, though. Okay, cool. I'm all, I'm all geared out. Uh, I think this probably leads further down. All those poor folk who got done over by the fake high priest are still alive, ain't they? Yeah, I knew it. I've seen them coming back up from uh, Pilgrim's Perdition Place. Hopefully my fellow's on his way back too. I can't wait to see him. 
To think I didn't have the first clue that monsters had captured all trades Abbey. That's useless. Alright, let's head down here. There are so many different vocations out there. How is anyone supposed to make up their mind? Excellent question. By rolling the dice. Thank God I can save my game. Thank the Almighty. Gotta go all Dragon Quest on this. Yeah, we'll continue. Alright, let's move on. Did you know the high priest here was just a little girl? I'm worried about changing my job now. How could I be sure she really knows what she's doing, eh? There's no need to get the job changing jitters, you know? Even if you switch vocations, you're not gonna go back to level one or anything. Oh no, you could put that thought right out of your head. So if you've got a lot of adventuring ahead of you, you might as well try your hand at a career of some kind. Do you know why those monsters were stealing people's powers? Oh, you do, do you? My word, news travels fast. So what do you think, sis? I suit being a warrior, wouldn't you say? I know it might be dangerous, but I'm gonna have to fight hard and make money do all I can to cure your illness. No! I can't let you put yourself in danger. What if you get hurt? I'm not going to. I'm tougher than you think, okay? And I'm only gonna get tougher. I'm already tougher than that Eustace, so you won't need to rely on him anymore. From now on, anything you want, just ask me. Stop it! Just stop it! It's too much! What makes you think I want people going out of their way to help me all the time? Stop making a martyr of yourself for my sake. I'm not being a martyr, I'm your brother. I love you and I want to do the best for you, that's all. It's too much, don't you see? You always make me feel like I'm a burden to you. You have to carry. Can't you see how difficult that makes things for me? Sometimes I almost wish you weren't here trying to look after me all the time. Oh, I get it. So you're trying to tell me that I'm the burden. <laughs> Fine. Does the link not work? Okay, I'll fix the link after the stream. But yes, I am on Twitter. Perfect, thank you, Black Trife. Uh, not Mirror Apprentice? Okay, uh, when you remind me after the stream and I will, uh, fix the link. I don't know why it went to Mirror Gaming. I don't remember typing that, but okay. I'm gonna buy a sword, alright? A warrior needs a sword, doesn't he? Welcome to the stream, Black Trife. I really appreciate the follow. I'm sorry, I don't want to speak to anyone right now. This book gives access to the most advanced vocations, but they're only available to those who have mastered more everyday forms of employment first. Do you wish to read it? Alright. So, Gladiator. You must master the Warrior and Martial Artist, Armamentalist, the Warrior and Mage, Sage, Mage and Priest, Luminary, Dancer, Jester, and Troubadour, Monster Master, Thief and Shepherd, Pirate, Thief and Sailor, Paladin, Martial Artist and Priest, Champion, Gladiator and Paladin, Druid, Sage and Luminary, Hero, available only to those who master a select variety of vocations, and Monster Vocations. Mirror become goops. I can't yet. I don't have a slime heart. Ready to be amazed? I can tell far how far you've advanced in your vocations just by looking at you. Interested? None of you have taken up any vocations yet. Come and see when you have. When you change vocations, you'll learn the spells and abilities associated with your new career choice. With a basic job like a warrior or a priest, then be able to use those spells and abilities no matter what vocation you change to. But be aware that it's different with more advanced vocations. The ones that can only be accessed after honing your skills in a basic vocation to a high level. In the case of these particular jobs, there are spells and abilities that can only be used while you are following that career path. Alright, cool. Let's go downstairs for a moment before we uh, 
Can I go in here now? Oh, it's unlocked. Perfect. Sorry, my new uh, page that uh, Wintrigue actually designed for me. It's still got some kinks in it. I'm not the best with uh, creating links and uh, and such, so she helps me out quite a bit with that stuff. Well, the one piece of good news about that monster soldier in here in the Abbey is that they did not think to change the decor. I would have hated to come back here and find carvings of the Demon King or anything awful like that. Well, they had to keep up the illusion that uh, the Abbey was real. So if the people were anything like me, they would have just ran around exploring. That would have been good for you. Hey, another prayer ring. I like prayer rings. They were really good in Dragon Quest 2. And 3. I used them a bunch in those. Altered Abbey is really, really big. It makes my house look really small and rubbish. I could see that. If any monsters ever think about coming back here, I'm going to pick up a sword and fight them off myself. Hey, see the shrink. Cool. Okay, so how much damage does stepping on this electric field do? Uh, 175 HP. It does one. First step, though. Metal. That hurt a little bit. Not a significant amount, though, that I'm gonna be in dire straits or anything anytime soon. I have to run around on that for a little bit before it kills me. As a reward for rescuing the High Priestess, Eustace has been promoted to the commander of her personal guard. I'll just have to get used to taking orders from yet another person much younger than me, I suppose. Sosa looks at the bookshelves. Picks up what looks like a ledger. It contains a list of every priest who works at Altered Abbey, along with marks out of ten in a range of categories. Well, that's always nice. You guys are being graded for your efforts. Hey, see the life. I want that. A yellow fragment! I'll use the seeds later, after I pick jobs. Sasha places the yellow fragment in the bag. What a coincidence, we needed yellow fragments. There's also another one we need to pick up, actually. We'll worry about that after, though. So Nev ran upstairs to buy a sword? Is that what he did? I don't know where he went. Stop being an asshole or something. Alright, let's go, uh... Pick ourselves. Oh, no. There he is. So you're leaving Neva behind? It's clear I'm only going to be causing her trouble. If I hang around, it's better this way. I will be very happy to look after her in your stead. But I need to know that I have your blessing. Look, this is between you and my sister. It's none of my business. I, I see. Well, good luck on your journey. Thanks. Look after her, okay? A warm welcome to All Trades Abbey. Welcome to Alte Jabby, but the vocation for you is only a wish away. Human beings are remarkable creatures, though through hard work and perseverance, they can discover abilities they never knew they had. Or right, for all we know, one of our visitors could one day become a find a vocation here that would enable them to save the world. Hmm, now that I might think about it, that must be the reason the Demon King sealed this island off from the others in the first place. That's the reason he always seals this place off. Hey, thanks for the, uh, host, Black Trife. 
kick your person in the FC has the same voice as you? You're gonna find that a lot eventually. If not for your courage and commitment, all trades Abbey would still be in the hands of monsters. Now that we have the Bla Abbey back, we are fortifying our defenses so that this can never happen again. I know some believe this fate befell us because a mere child was serving as high priestess. Which makes it imperative that, that I do all I can to ensure our enemies never again view us as an easy target. In any case, you have my heartfelt gratitude, but I am sure you did not come here for idle chat. You stand in the hallowed halls of Altrade's Abbey, where those seeking fresh beginnings may embark on a new journey in life. Do you or one of your members wish to change vocation? Alright, so we already picked Satsuri's uh, job, if you remember, and that was Warrior. So Sasori would like to pursue the path of warriors, is this correct? Very well, Sasori. Fill your heart and with the visions of the becoming a warrior and join me in prayer. Oh, mighty arbiter of vocations, permit me your servant, Sasori, to tread a new path in life. It is done. Henceforth shall Sasori tread the path of the warrior. Now begins the first day of the rest of your life, and the first step on the journey to master of your chosen vocation. But perhaps someone else wishes to pursue a new path in life. Maribel! What is Maribel going to be? Let's see. We got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I guess I got 9 choices here. So let's get a 10 sided dice. Uh, yes, there we go. We get 3. Uh, okay. A cleric in the service of all that is holy and who is able to heal spells and cast heal allies and cast protective spells. Okay. She loses all her stats except for wisdom. Whatever. There we go. And now let's give rough. I love that they created uh, different looks for every job for every character in this. That makes me happy. What job would Ruff like to take on? He can be martial artist, mage, dancer, thief, troubadour, sailor, shepherd, or jester. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Alright, I got an eight sided diary in here somewhere. Where the fuck is that thing? Advil, no. Aha! There it is. Five. One, two, three, four, five. All right. A multi-talented musician whose raise of massive repertoire has a range of uses. Increases style. Okay. Well, uh, you're going to be a troubadour. Probably not the best job selection, but we, we, we do what the dice tells us. We got a decent selection for Sassari and Maribel. Nope, that's all we got. Okay, so now, is there an easy way down to the uh, lower part of the the island there? Or? Well, it looks like there is. Cool. Oh, hello, cat. Some clusters and some drake slimes. Now, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to uh, get any job levels for a bit because I did over-level for the two characters there. Ruff will be okay for a little while. I could actually take Ruff to the uh, slime area that one of my viewers has been telling me works. Crap. But. There he goes! Ah, the poor thing just wants to be looked after. Tell the slime knight about monster meadows? Oh yeah, have fun. See you later, buddy. Enjoy your time in Monster Meadows. Okay, so we're coming back down here for a reason. So if you remember Pilgrim's Tradition, we spent a good amount of time here. There was a... Stone here, and we're gonna go see it. What's this guy still doing here? I'm afraid this town isn't long for this world, you know? Everything that happened here, all the drama with the Soul Stealer, it will all be gone soon. 
Like so much dust in the wind. Yay, another yellow fragment. I am the best. Another seat of strength. Seed of magic, I will give that to Maribel. Okay, seed of magic to Maribel. Seed of wisdom, I will give to Maribel. There you go. And where is my seed of strength? Seventy strength, that's not bad. Seventy-three strength. And I'll get that to Sassari saw. By four, okay, it puts him a lot closer to uh where we wanna. I think that's the only reason to be here, so we got the we got that. Now we're gonna head back to the teleportal. It's been a long time, uh, this this part took us a few days worth of stream to do. Don't oh, regret it though, I had fun. We gotta get to the next area so I can start job leveling all my characters, not just Ruff. I don't want Ruff to be like super job leveled or anything. Using the slime area that my uh, YouTube uh, viewer told me about, um, I could actually get Ruff to have uh, the hero vocation, but I don't want to do that. I mean, I'm not that interested in cheesing the game. Plus, I'd have to fight slimes, and that's just not worth it. Hello. Okay, so we only have some yellow. Okay, so... Do we have any for this pillar? We do not. Absolutely none for that one. We don't have any for that one. Ooh, that was that's kind of surprising. What about this one? Ah, we have one for this one. All right, let's deposit it here for now. There you go. Oh, that island's looking slightly more complete than before. Same with that one. Alright. So we're out of the way now. So we know there's a yellow pistol... Uh, pistol? A yellow... Uh, pillar fragment at the... Uh, corner there. Um, or at the uh, excavation site. But, um, I don't know where any others are, except probably in Altered's Abbey, uh, in the present here. So we're not going to explore there. Yet. We're just stopping here to uh, heal up a bit for free. Okay, so... Down the stairs we go. Let's go save our game now. That'll be a good place to pause the recording.
All right. Yeah, we're gonna continue. So, last to stop recording for a moment. <laughs> 